Hello and welcome. This section of, excuse me, this video is about the section of the game that is called Tasks. And you can find it at the top right corner of the screen when you tap on it. The uh, third, fourth, fifth one down right below Crafts, or second one, right below Craft is called Tasks. I'll go ahead and go into this. And what am I looking at? Well, you're looking at these are quests that you can do uh, daily quests to knock out and achievement quests uh, an achievement quest is as simple as acquire uh, a million or ten million silver or participate in a normal arena these are these are things that take a bit of time to accomplish but once you do the rewards are nice the daily I wanted to explain that what is highlighted is left to do for daily tasks. So I still need to complete a boss rush uh, three times, uh, use hit point potion 20 times, and you can see the rewards on the right hand side and the progress I made towards it. Uh, the ones that I just shy away from just right now is the Ramonis daily bonuses. So I'm missing out on <laughs> some pretty good stuff if I would just jump into Ramonis and do it uh, really nice stuff so if I earned 160 points that just exponentially grows 240 points just keeps growing compared to well I guess it's the same thing isn't it five twos and ten five twos and ten well oh, okay there it is you get more points, they give you the same stuff, except you just get a lot of it. And then uh, all the way down to 400 points will give you boss stamps, ancient tablets. This, this, getting boss stamps and ancient tablets is not terribly easy in this game. you got to do a lot of stuff. But if you enjoy Ramonis and you earn 400 points easily, well, there you go. That's knocked out, no problem. Uh, let's see, uh, complete tower trials and synthesize an alchemy stone. So they throw you some silver for doing these things. These are things that you normally would do in a day. And if you're not aware of it, then it's something you can incorporate into what you do. So when I get up in the morning, I dedicate 30 minutes to knocking out my daily tasks and just going through the whole gambit of everything I can possibly do before I uh, settle on farming for the remainder of the day and doing my, my black spirit quests because it's a kill quest and you gotta kill like 6,000 people to knock all three of them out uh, that's a total each one is I think 2,000 each but here's an example of, or here's what I do in the morning I well, actually, the visual is a lot better, but Ancient Ruins, Collect Three Herbs, Normal Arena, uh, Black Spirit Quest, that's when I'm farming and knocking out him. Uh, use 10,000 silver, they'll give you five back. Good job, you saved. Uh, defeat one world boss, it's a little tough to do in a 30 minute span, and the world bosses are on their own time schedule, but when you do find one, uh, during the day and you knock it out, there it is. Uh, I'm in a guild, obviously, so I check in and they give me 10 boss, uh, boss stamps. I complete a guild quest, they give me 20 ancient tablets. So, as you can see, there's even getting the stones from your refinery using 50 stamina. I mean, that's part of what I do, is I collect uh, the crystals and use up 50 stamina in doing it, boom, knock that out. And what I really wanted to show you is this spot right here. You get one, two, three, four, five. You get, did I count that right? Three, no, it's four. I thought there was one more. Ah, uh, yeah. Participate in normal arena. Five black pearls for doing something very easy plant a garden every morning so receive your crops because you did uh, merchantry the night before put in new crops bam 
Black Pearl. Order your workers uh, to gather. That's a normal given because when you wake up, they should be ready for you in the morning to say, hey, what do you want us to do? You put us on overnight. So this is an easy one to get. Even dispatch workers and node manager is something where they're like, hey, give us something to do. We're ready to do five black pearls. When you knock out as much as this is, then you get these at the bottom. Three, three of them completed, daily task completed, six and nine. So five, I earned five for just doing those things. And then the three completed will give me five more black pearls. And the six will give me five more black pearls. So that's 15 right there. Did I count right? Five, yeah, that's 15. And the nine will throw in 10. So that's 25 black pearls a day for doing something that will take you less than 30 minutes to do every day. And as soon as I do all of my quests out in the city and collect everything and, and just get everything dialed in, I come into my camp and collect everything. Uh, like these things right here, the hand, it's free resources. So you collect that, you look for a guy who uh, has a, a green circle around him that will give you a uh, quest. Uh, it looks like not right now, but I collect on my monument and get 50 stamina and uh, then just start knocking them out. Uh, you do the gardening, so I knock out a garden. See, I don't collect on my garden completely every day. I leave some open for when I need it. But I definitely use up the first garden in the morning, every morning, to complete that daily task. And then come over here and do the ancient ruins. Then come over here and do the node manager. And do the boss rush when I have time. It just You just have to finish it three times. That's it. If you have a times three multiplier on it, bam, you did it one shot. And... Uh, you know, collect on your ranch, and just do various other things that you can do to knock out, once again, the tasks, the daily tasks. So, so yeah, I collect three herbs, I do my guild quests, and match up collecting five herbs from the guild quest and three herbs from my daily task. So it's all about stacking, stacking these quests uh, together so that you do it once and then collect five herbs and it knocked out two quests maybe three quests if the uh, oh what was that called confirm uh, oh rats I'm not in a town okay let's go to a town sorry about that so when I'm in a town I uh, focus on knocking out the daily quests and there's something that's pretty cool. There it is. It's called Bounty Mission. So if you go to the Bounty Mission and it says, hey, I want you to collect five herbs. Great. I'll go to my guild quest. Hey, I want you to collect five herbs. You go and do your daily task, which is automatically ready for you. So, okay, you collect five herbs. You, you just collected or finished three quests at the, tame, at the same time. We're having a good day on vocabulary, aren't we? So uh, this is the tips that I'm trying to explain to you to get into a routine. Like I said, I just dedicate 30 minutes every morning to knocking out uh, the daily stuff and going around Robin around my camp and doing all those things. Even Path of Glory, I knock out Path of Glory and... Uh, Oh, the arena, in case you didn't know this, I'll show you a really nice secret that my guildmate showed me a long time ago. You have to finish an arena, right? You go in, and it's a normal arena. So you select normal arena, you start the match, and it searches for someone. And the minute the match starts, <laughs> you stun your opponent. You hit the top right corner of the exit and confirm quest complete there it is they're happy you're happy you just finished a daily quest yeah sure you took a defeat 
But, like I said, within 30 minutes, you knock out your daily quests. So, that is something I do in the morning. Maybe people are like, oh, I know that person, he always quits. And one of these days, I'm going to actually fight people. But, for now, I'm trying to get as strong as I can so I can enjoy the PvP and all of that. But to go back to our tasks, I still got to do the boss rush and uh, use a hit point potion if I want to. 20 hit point potions for 5,000? Uh, let's explain something. That was 5,000 silver, right? Let's go to the potion person. And their shop. So, there it is. 20 potions, and let's see if this appears. I'm gonna throw a calculator in the middle of this. So, 20 times 9, and for all you math majors, that's 900, is 18,000 silver you have to spend to finish that, well, that's if you purchase the most expensive potion. Let's go back. If I did... Uh, I know that's simple math if I was to do it this way, but if I did uh, 20 times 200, that's 4,000 silver at small hit point potion. So, uh, not to put down the mechanics of the task, but they give you 5,000 silver back. So you, for your effort, you earned 1,000 silver um, nah. You gotta look at these things. It's an, you, it looks like it's repeatable. You can do it over and over. Uh, no, you can do it, it looks like maybe up to 20, I, I don't know. I think it's repeatable. But it's just not worth it. Unless your character type is one who goes through potions and needs the potions, then this is gonna work for you. But for me, for a uh, spell casting class, nope. Won't be doing this one anytime soon unless it's an event or uh, Ramonis or PvP, somewhere where I'm definitely using potions. I have to use them. Then, hey, what do you know? They kicked me down 5,000. But to actually make an effort to buy potions, to do the potions, and get the reward, mm -mm, not worth it. So, I hope that explains uh, what the tasks are about. These achievements, again, feel free to tap on the Achievements tab and just take a look at them. Uh, a lot of them are pretty beefy. You know, equip 60 crystals, catch 300 fish. Wow, 300 fish? And they'll give you 20 black pearls. Oh, that's pretty good. Tame 5 wild horses and they'll give you 5 black pearls. So, if you're looking for a way of getting more black pearls come over here take a look at these things and uh, see if uh, wow, there's a lot uh, see if you need silver or black pearls or whatever other kind of resource that they're offering you know like uh, poor armor black stone for 30 fish you know, sell 30 fish so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, end out the video but wanted to uh, let you know that this is how the the task section of the game works and you know I wish you well and just get into a routine of doing it and it'll be one of many ways that you earn resources to get what you want done that is just one sliver of so many things that you can do every day in less amount of time to get a lot of resources so with that I'll say thank you for watching this video and you have yourself a wonderful day. Bye now.